welcome to the Mad Science Writing Show with Carrie and Jenny. Those of you who tuned in last week will be happy to know the cat has made a full recovery. In today's episode, we are going to explore writing with alchemy. Fascinating, but what exactly is alchemy? Well, it's a complicated subject that goes back thousands of years. Oh, in that case, I'm going to go take a nap while you explain it. No, I'll make it quick. Okay. Alchemy was an early form of elemental chemistry, with some magic thrown in for good measure. Like card tricks. A little more mystical than that. Oh, like Harry Potter and casting spells on people. No, not quite that mystical. Oh, rabbit in the hat. Got it. Anyway, one of the ancient goals of alchemy was turning lead into gold, but these days it has a more symbolic meaning. Which is? The act of transforming basic or common elements in a mysterious or extraordinary way. I see where you're going with this. In the case of writers, we all start with the same alphabet which can then become Romeo and Juliet. Or Fifty Shades of Grey. Cool. So you're telling me that great writing is part science and part magic. More like part formula, part imagination. Hmm, really? Yes, I happen to have a recipe book right here. So let's get cooking. Hang on. Oh, this looks way too complicated. I think we should just wing it. Isn't writing all about being creative and getting in the zone? Just writing what's in our imagination and what we feel? Like I said a minute ago, that's only part of it. There are also rules and formulas to follow if you want to write a great book. I don't agree. I think it all comes from here. Okay then, how about we have a little contest? I will do it by the book. Ha ha. And you can wing it. Then we see whose is better. You're on. Well, this a little heavy-handed with the adverbs. The, the run-on sentences are a little hard to digest. Um, the conflict didn't really rise for me. And, well, the characters are a little like sandy cardboard. But, still a compelling mix of Genres and uh, honestly, it makes me w want more. Though I'll Excellent. probably regret it. Though, like, just like bacon wrapped Twinkies. Oh. <clears throat> All right, let's see here. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Those are good. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Um, has a very pleasing balance of action and exposition. Mm -hmm. the dialogue is fresh, but it's it's missing something, and that certain spice that just makes it pop. But it definitely has potential. So who wins? First drafts never win. 
but keep at it. I can't wait to sink my teeth into your final products. Excellent. It's been a fun show today, but we're almost out of time. I hope you enjoyed our brief exploration into the alchemy of writing. Join us next week when special guest Chuck Wendig gives us five safety tips on what to do when encountering a hostile group of genetically engineered ants. <laughs>